has just been fantastic. Oh, I loved it. It was fun. I thought today was fantastic. It was very engaging. Yeah, I really felt it went well. I'm an engineer and we just usually talk to each other, so this is really refreshing and uh, you know, it's a breath of fresh air to, to come to these sessions. We need to be able to prepare in order to be able to be resilient. It's going to take a concerted effort and construction needs to be part of that conversation. The whole intent of the symposium was really to talk about actionable strategies. And so I think the key takeaway was is that the BC Construction Association, through this whole forum, really can take a leadership position with other agencies around emergency preparedness. So be it having an inventory of skilled workers doing rapid building assessments or taking care of ourselves to build back better, we need to have all those conversations to figure out where we're going to play a role effectively in the situation. I think this is something that is much needed and something we have to continue to uh, use in the years to come. I could actually see aha moments in the people's eyes. Over the years, I know that we have been missed as an industry. I know that we have not been utilized as effectively as we should be. We tend to forget about what our construction partners, what our construction industry can do for us in, in response recovery and even mitigation. It works in that space of the gap between, you know, like the research that we are doing or, or the instruments that we are using and the person that is using it at the end of the day. And I think the key message from this is let's not stop it here.